Hey, what's up everybody? It's Richie here with something really, really cool for you guys, and that is basically the smallest scorekeeper, or scoreboard if you prefer, in the game of Minecraft. And the way this works is really simple. You just put a redstone input into this dispenser right here, and every time you score a goal in your game, or whatever you're counting, it will just turn on another light. So it'll keep counting all the way up to 10. This build can actually support up to 12. And then when you want to reset it, you can just pick up all the shovels and throw them back in here. Now, as I say that, you're probably wondering, wait a second, why do I have to reset it myself? I'm pretty sure there are other scoreboards, and in those, you don't have to do any of that. And yes, there are other scoreboards, but the problem is they look something like this. And basically, the sole purpose of this build over here is to be easy to build, very easy to set up, and very tiny. And as a result, it does have a few limitations. Number one is that whatever you're doing can't last longer than five minutes because, well, these shovels over here will despawn. And number two is, as I've said before, it will not clear itself automatically. Though if you really want that, you can set up a minecart under here that will go down and then up and back around. And you can just hook the minecart rail up to another circuit that you can activate to reset the entire thing. And without further ado, guys, let's get into how to build this thing. Now, the first thing you wanna do is pick how many lamps you want. You can have a number between one and 12, but you know, one would be pretty pointless. So we're gonna go with a nice steady five. And then what you gotta do is grab some solid blocks and place them right behind your lamps and then throw some redstone on them. From there, we're gonna decide which side it's gonna light up from. Basically, if it's gonna go right to left or left to right. So just to be a rebel, I think I wanna start my build on the right. So what we're gonna do is go behind the first block and then place a weighted pressure plate that's light, in other words, a gold pressure plate right there. And then we're gonna come out here and make a ring of glass except for this block right here. I know it's a little hard to see, but what we wanna do is place a dispenser facing inward into this ring. So we have this little ring of glass just like this with a dispenser on it. And surprisingly, that's actually your build done. If you want more storage, which you probably do, just plop a hopper and a chest right there, open up your chest and fill it up with non-stackable items. I like to use wooden shovels because, well, they're cheap and you're never gonna use them for anything else. And from there, we're just gonna put a redstone input into the back of this. Now, of course, if you were designing some sort of a game, you would hook this up to the goal of your game and have a wire going all the way over here. But your build is actually now done, and you can test it out right now. So if we press this button, the scoreboard will read that we have a score of one, and then two, and then three, four, and five. And when we want to reset it, we can just stand over here and pick up all the shovels. And like I said, if you want to make an automatic collection system, then go ahead. But this build is really more for setting up things really quick, and if you're gonna make something very permanent, I would recommend a build along the lines of this one. But anyway, guys, I hope you like this video. I certainly had a ton of fun building this. I actually spent quite a lot of time on it, probably too much. But until the next time, guys, this has been Richie, and I'm out. I'll see ya.